Ahead of International Women's Day, we wanted to look at how diversity is crucial to good policy making and to look at how local government can ensure that their teams are diverse and that their policy outcomes reflect the communities they represent. Too many areas of policy um, covered by local government that are still male dominated and I'm thinking of infrastructure, highways, planning, etc. The most important thing is to put women in positions of responsibility in those areas, leading by example, reflecting the needs of their communities and making a difference. What is really important is that we, we actually reach out and, and that we make sure that we find ways and we facilitate as many people from as many different backgrounds becoming involved in local government. I think it's really interesting that Bobsy and I represent sport and culture in our district and we provide a very strong voice at the table, not just for black uh, and ethnic minority communities, but also in terms of women and girls. We love what we do and we do feel our role is to sort of diversify the workforce. We feel we've got a role and a responsibility of making a difference to the people that live in this district. I think diversity is a really good thing because um, we really do need to make sure that um, we understand and we're reacting to the needs of our community and to the needs of our residents. As a passionate feminist and winner of the transformational leader for Northern Powerhouse Women, I'd really like to talk about our Believe in Her campaign. We started it two years ago to try to promote uh, confidence in women, particularly young women and girls at school and just starting out in the world of work. We passionately believe in it and we really want you to do so as well. I also feel as a female leader that it's really important that um, we do always have a very mixed group, a very mixed cabinet and executive, which is what I have. And I find that as a result of that, we've really been able to draw on our experience um, to start to really move through a lot of changes and really move our council on to the next level. I was really inspired to work in local government because I think it's such an important area to work and I think that you need all kinds of people working in local government. Uh, so I'm really early on in my leadership journey but I'm really looking forward to um, progressing and, and, and giving back to local government. If there are any men out there who are watching these films and thinking that uh, this hasn't really got much to do with them then then I'm afraid you're, you're wrong okay because uh, we men have an absolutely pivotal role to play in supporting our female colleagues uh, to reach their full potential and that's across the piece from calling out sexist misogynist behavior wherever and whenever we see it through to making sure and calling out those meetings that are basically stuffed full of men uh, or where there are very few women present and saying it's not acceptable through I think to ensuring in very simple terms that we are giving a space for all voices to be heard and for all contributions to be valued. We get as many people involved in local government as possible because what we need is we need that diversity to make sure that all aspects of our local community are represented and that the council ultimately does the best for our local residents and the wider community. It's not just women that struggle and have potentials of family and career, but quite often it's the case that they need that flexibility. So for me, it's about give and take and giving the flexibility and using agile working so that I know if somebody has to leave off at four o'clock to look after their caring responsibilities, I know that they'll always get the job done. I also think that you need all kinds of different leaders in local government, men and women and, and all kinds of different people. And I think men and women can bring really different things to the table in leadership position and I think I would you know so more generally if we want to make life better for people which is the whole point of public service we need to represent people that are in our communities this is really important and it's everybody's job to do this we need more women in leadership positions across all sectors because that's the way we'll create a fairer more equitable and even society happy international women's day Make sure you do your bit.